Hey, what up, Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? Welcome to my uh, Z Block, aka Fall 76 video. Uh, this is the video I wanted to make uh, for a very long time, but uh, I don't know. I couldn't find the correct words, so basically, in this video, I'll cover uh, everything that happened in December 2019. Uh, why did I switch from PC to Xbox? Was I planning to continue playing on PC? Uh, general feedback f in about the entire game since beta because that's when I started playing and I was playing on PC I got character over level 400 over there and uh, nuclear winter will gonna touch base and basically all of that stuff uh, in one thing so for starters uh, let me start off why did I select uh, Fallout 76 uh, to make content on well first of all I was looking for an MMO I wasn't uh, hyped about 76. I was looking for a brand new MMO, uh, something with uh, competition, PvP, you know, uh, g creating guilds, because uh, I wanted a game so I can play with you guys, right? So that was the main reason I took Fallout 76, not because I was a big fan of Fallout games. Uh, it was because um, I wanted to find a good MMO. So. Uh, when the game started and we had bugs, I was I was like okay because I predicted those bugs. I predicted a lot of a lot of things with this game. When uh, not only cosmetics, when you know first repair kits came out, I predicted that membership. I predicted that as well. It was it's all very predictable, right? So uh, when the game released, yeah, it was bad. I couldn't understand why everybody was so um, annoyed that there are no uh, NPCs. I was kind of annoyed, but not super, because the game at that point gave me everything that I wanted, right? Basically, what I was feeling about. And uh, we got the survival mode. Man, I loved that mod. Uh, me, Hammett, Ranger, Karakoha, those are the guy. That's our uh, team and survival mode that we played before the hackers came in, cheaters and all the cockroaches, you know. So we had a blast. I leveled up so many levels thanks to that uh, mod, especially on double XP events, because you know when you were playing the survival mode, you was getting 20% experience. Then with the double, that's 40% experience. You sleep, that's 5% plus double, 10%. You take all that, you add that up, and you just skyrocket your level. So we would jump from like 30 minimum levels, no problemo, and had a good time in PvP as well. Uh, the number one thing that I was fearing, like the game started getting these issues, I never, uh, since ever I heard dupers, first of all, I didn't even understand what the hell that was back in the day when it kind of, kind of started going. Because I was avoiding all the exploits videos, all the life hack whatever videos. You know, I don't like cheaters so bad. So I played, I bought many games. Uh, online games and they were full of cheaters so uh, back like at the start of 2019 maybe 18 I don't remember exactly when maybe it was at the end of 2018 I made a call that I'm gonna be switching to uh, console gaming with the new generation so I was aiming for Xbox Scarlet to get away from the cheaters because I did a lot of research I asked you guys you confirmed it uh, you can't hack consoles only do exploits if the game allows you to do exploits. Bethesda. Yeah, Bethesda. You gotta fix your... <clears throat> yeah, I'm getting a little bit, you know... <laughs> I mean, don't get me wrong. I don't hate the game. I love the game. It has potential. But it needs a lot of work. That that's That's the truth. From a perspective of a person who was looking for an MMO, this game is lacking on a lot of things. Uh, creating your own guilds, for example. Why not allow us to create our own factions? You know, kind of like get like a, a faction of 50 people, for example, with a minimum. Taking an example of Division 2 that I'm playing right now, they have the uh, guild creation. Guild has a separate uh, kind of like to do list, weekly challenges, uh, quests, 
uh, clan points, clan vendor, and so on. That is cool. That makes you c collaborate and do the stuff together, you know? Yeah, private worlds is good. But eight people? Are you serious for an MMO? Eight people? No. That's... No. Nah. <laughs> but still, that, that's... Just don't get me wrong here. I, I'm not blasting garbage on this game. I like this game. I played this game. Not as much as previously, but still. As you can see, uh, all these trophies from the nuclear winter. And speaking of nuclear winter, if it wasn't for the nuclear winter, I most probably would have quit in playing Fallout 76 back in December. And that's honest truth. So, when I decided to make the switch to Xbox, I was, I was thinking about all the PC uh, Fallout 76 Z Clan members as well. It wasn't an easy call for me as well. And I wanted to find a way of collaborating. And I did mention that on the streams. But I just can't. I don't have enough time, unfortunately. The other thing is, what I get a lot of uh, comments, not just today, not just since the hand mentioned, pointed out. I, I, I got those comments throughout the, pa the past, like, I would say February. -ish. February, it all started in the start of February. Yo Z, your channel is dying. Your Z, your uh, is a wanker. I don't even know the uh, the name of the, the meaning of that word, but I understood it's something bad. <laughs> that you know, the channel is dying and so on, and so forth. Blah 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 blah. Look, I'm not that YouTuber. Okay, uh, I I like doing YouTube. I love it, really. If I wouldn't love it, I would quit long time ago. What is YouTube to me? It, at the moment is a hobby and it was a big dream of mine back in the day which I put in a big box locked it up with the key and threw it away and only after six years I found that key unlocked the box and started doing stuff that was back in 2017 uh, now I have a kid nine months old so minus time full-time job minus time wife minus time so uh, I don't have a lot of time to like dedicate myself into YouTube but still speaking of as someone Z clan member probably running around <laughs> I'm on the private world hello so basically uh, oh man yeah, I don't script my videos as you know I want to do that I tried doing it but I don't know I kind of sound like a robot I'm not being me and this channel is all about me being me and do the stuff that I want to do you know this is this is me I don't want to pretend that I'm doing stuff that I don't like I'm gonna be honest with you I got really frustrated with this game really frustrated and I keep trying to find uh, those you know strings that w would keep me playing at least the adventure mode but I was planning to play the adventure mode in March to uh, do all the quests before the Wastelanders DLC comes out. I started playing, uh, w like, I dedicated an entire day to play the adventure mode. I was playing it, but I, I got, um, I don't know, I just can't force myself. <laughs> you know, and this is where the DLC comes in. I really hope that the DLC will bring my wanting to play the adventure mode. Now, the other thing is, what pisses me off, I know most of the guys don't care about it, but for me, it's something, it's a must. Uh, for some guys, it's not because uh, you came in as a, fo uh, as a Fallout, from the Fallout series, right? Single player gaming and so on, and you don't care much about what other people think or what other people own. In my perspective, when I was playing MMO, and you grind so you put so many hours into the game you find your own weapons you make it you found those cool super legendaries and then some cockroaches dupe them and main point for me in the adventure mode was hold on let me uh, sort of mute myself and say thank you to a Z clan member who's shooting their rail gun or whatever did he leave <laughs> what's up <laughs> sloth don't, don't shoot that gun because I don't script my videos it's hard for me to find the correct words you say ah distraction 
<laughs> so yeah, um, so if it wasn't for the nuclear winter mod, I was more probably quit the game. And as I was saying, the adventure mode for me was I was trying to, um, like farm the cool stuff, get the stuff, you know, uh, feel good about it that, yo, it took me so much time to get to, come on sloth, <laughs> like it took me so much time to grind a specific unique weapon, right, and I would feel happy about it, you know, but once you go like, if you just even google buy Fallout 76 weapons, you'll see how much trash of third party websites there are. How many people are selling those laser explosives or everything duped? On PC, the case is even worse because you got those hacked weapons and stuff. It was just ridiculous. And I think if I would stayed uh, and not move to the Xbox and that weapon a hack thing would have come, that was the day when I would quit. But luckily for me, I already made the switch, the transition to Xbox. And I knew that when I was going to make the transition, this channel is going to suffer. Uh... But okay, I was willing to take that risk. As I told you before, I will say it again. It's to me, it's not about the numbers. It's not about the views. It's not about uh, how many subscribers I got. Z Clan, it's family to me. You don't count your family members. I think. I hope. <laughs> you know, I'm just having fun with you guys. That's it. That's what I'm trying. That's my point. I hope you understand me correctly, because sometimes I cannot express myself what I have here, and you know, kind of express it. I'm on a, I'm working on it um uh, to get better to start doing some sort of news but that will t come in the end sometime. This channel will grow, I know, because I know that hard work pays off. I know that by experience in real life cuz I've been l l let's not touch that topic. But I know for a fact that I hit some mountains that back in the day I thought it was not possible for me but because I'm like oh, oh. you man you man let's do this and I started the grind basically I'm just being me this is me and I love it <laughs> same with YouTube I'm just being me that's it I'm not trying to pretend some to be someone I'm not trying to do stuff that uh, I don't know I'm just trying to be me that's it you know and I hope you understand me correctly so this game it really needs a lot of work still a lot of work and this game Bethesda you better understand that this DLC is your last freaking chance and if you mess it up oh I don't know how many people will leave most probably I'll continue doing some videos for Fallout 76 but my playtime with Fallout 76 will definitely drop and uh, definitely drop uh, speaking of, well, Nuclear Winter, I'm having fun, so don't get me wrong there. I try to do those highlights. We play sometime offline, and you know, we could, I could do that Nuclear Winter, and uh, with hopes that some, at some point, this game will actually level up. You know, uh, even <laughs> with Xbox, uh, I don't know if you saw that video when I was doing the Atomic Shop. I did mention that I did something stupid. <laughs> so definitely I'm going to be playing for a year because I accidentally bought the year plan. <laughs> well, follow, uh, follow first. That was a mistake. Uh, basically, the mistake was I had the monthly membership turned on and I thought, he, like, and I canceled it and I thought if I am to re, uh, like, reopen it, like, you know, resubscribe. And instead of resubscribing, I <laughs> I extended it well I thought it was extension to uh, keep the one month one month and then when I uh, kind of like didn't read into things I learned my lesson next time when I'm doing something with the mon online money better read more in depth uh, especially on Xbox and I'm, and I'm like click yes and then I see not 99 9 99 I'm like, oh damn okay fine <laughs> so I'll keep covering the atomic shop that's for sure cuz uh, that's um, where many of you came in and um, you find that useful. I know it kind of like creates a lot of videos on my channel etc but many of you find it useful and I'll keep doing it. 
So even uh, I'm gonna st try to start resuming my uh, reviews of the atomic shop items that I buy but first I don't want to spend a lot of money on atoms right now because I did spend a lot of money on this game and uh, yeah uh, I still need to get back on my PC character to do the reviews for the items that I wanted to do the reviews but I just never had the time to do the review for that specific bundle or item or so on and so forth so am I gonna jump on that uh, do it over there upload it and like to have it uh, as I said in terms of Fallout 76 uh, the activity on this channel it all depends on, on Bethesda now and uh, my mood because I'm not gonna force myself to play something that I want or I don't want you know uh, well that I don't want that's what you force yourself to do something right now I'm having fun with nuclear winter with a lot of you guys and just recently started playing Division 2 and I'm having fun with that game as well uh, but I'm gonna be honest if within the next year or so I don't see no switches in this game in terms of MMO I'm gonna start looking for a new one I'm gonna start looking for a new MMO that has no dupers no glitchers no cheaters and something where you, we can all have fun that's what I wanted to do in the first place and I thought Fallout 76 would be that game but it's not definitely not in a current state but once again I'd like to point out I do not hate the game I love the game the game is good but there are a lot of aspects missing out from my personal point of view and I'm not gonna drop you know hate on this game even if I stop uh, playing it I'm not gonna do hate videos I don't like doing hate videos this is a positive channel it's like I intentionally most cases knowingly that I can hype on some thing I don't do it like exploits as well with that mini nuke that everybody knows already about we found that thing long time ago I was grieved by that method and back in the day it was um, me senpai uh, from PC remember him Ilya senpai and Terminator by the way and uh, we already started recording the video of warning about this exploit but then you guys wait Z you might not want to upload this and I'm like why wouldn't it be good to like let everybody know that this is possible and be careful and then the other comment came in but Z you're gonna promote it and people are gonna start doing it I'm like, okay okay that's a good point and at that point I was really frustrated because I almost got killed and I had a lot of junk on me and I was like man if this would have happened to me man I would be really angry and I wanted to kinda like you know I was in fire mode rage mode and I wanted to upload that uh, exp uh, that stupid nuke mine thing that can get you killed even if you have your pacifist mod turned on but if it wasn't for T or uh, Ilya Senpai who stopped me and say, yo, if you're going to do this, you might going to cause more trouble than good. I'm like, and then I'm like, oh, yeah, this is why I don't like covering exploits. And this is why I don't allow talks of exploits. I don't want to do not want to promote that stuff. I do not want to like, you know, I don't jump on those type of trains and whatever and talk about exploits show you how to do them or and so on and so forth I submit tickets I don't make it go public I don't hype on that stuff so what I'm getting at man I am so emotional right now <laughs> I'm just being me guys that's it and in terms of the gameplay and everything I, I will see we just go with the flow the Z clan we play different games and uh, you know it's not just about Fallout, and this channel is not just about Fallout. This is not a Fallout channel. This is a gaming channel in general. Fallout 76 is the main game of the channel, but that main game may change at some point, but not now. Or I don't know. I don't. I, I have barely time to play. I, I honestly myself right now I'm still ever since December in a confused situation. Sometimes I don't even know. What the hell am I doing, to be honest? <laughs> but I know for a fact that I'm having fun. I'm having fun playing Nuclear Winter.
even though I don't get the views. I'm having fun streaming Nuclear Winter, even though I don't get 40 viewers as we usually were on the channels, on the on the stream. Man, I can't even put my words together anymore. Like, previously when I was doing streams on the Adventure Mode on PC, we were having around 30 minimum uh, Z-Clan members watching, and then sometimes 50, once we skyrocketed to 70. <laughs> uh, with Nuclear Winter, it's around 10, and maximum 30, but not for long. So, the viewership uh, divided by 50%. The videos don't get a lot of those views of those highlight moments, although I, I do put a lot of work into it. But I still like to rewatch those myself because there are a lot of funny moments that I'm working on right now. We had a, a real blast playing yesterday offline, and I'm gonna upload that video. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna name, I'm gonna name it. Try not to laugh because that was that match was just hilarious. <laughs> oh man, man, I gotta stop talking. I'm pretty sure I haven't covered everything. I'm going to I'm going to maybe make a part 2 of this video and um I'm not even going to put mu music on the background I think. And uh I'm going to try to get all the bulletin points together. Uh but as once again, I barely have time to prepare myself for the videos. So that's why I don't have I do my scripts. I hope you all understand. I'm a weird YouTuber, and that, that's all you gotta understand. I'm a weird guy from Ukraine. That's it. It's <laughs> simple. Weird cockroach. <laughs> Alright, Z-Clan, and everybody else, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll catch you later. By the way, drop me your questions that you want to ask, and I will answer. You know, I read through all the comments, and I will answer. If you want to reach out to me directly, feel free to do it via Discord. If I don't reply, just follow up on me because I have a lot of chats, a lot of them. So if I don't, if I don't reply, it doesn't mean I don't want to. It's just I just missed it. So just follow up on me, and I'll get back to you. Uh, preferably, better to keep everything in one place. Maybe in the comment section, uh, your questions to me, your expectations, uh, your your feedback, and how do you feel? What do you feel? You know? <laughs> Alright, Z Clan. I've been chatting a lot. Anyway, thanks a lot for watching this video. If you watched it to the full, how many of you watched it to the full? Comment down below. I'm just super curious. Because so, I know in the analytics, sometimes uh, people call out, call out on, on the fifth minute or, so, or something like that. I just want to know how weird I am. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video, and uh, I hope it kind of answered some of your questions. I know there's still a lot of questions, so the best way, if you comment down d down below, I'm going to try to make an FAQ and uh, get back to you with already a more professional, detailed way, s saying, all right, this is what we got, da 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 and explain everything. I mean, once again, YouTube at the moment, it's not a full-time job. I don't have all the time that I wanted to dedicate to this channel. Uh, but I'm doing my best. And I put a lot of hours into it. Sometimes I miss sleep <laughs> because of it. Because this is a, a goal of mine. My goal is to make this a full-time job. Career. But, you know, actually that's even wrong. You can't say full-time job because you can't call a job when you like doing something. Basically... Here's a philo uh Confucius said, find a job you love and you will never have to work a single day in your life. That's how I look for real jobs based on this quote. And in my head, it becomes no longer a job. It becomes a second home. And YouTube is my home. And I want to make it a full-time home, not a job. All right, I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> y'all have a good one then Z-Clan I love you thanks for the support hi from Ukraine I'll catch y'all later <laughs>